Mushy Mushy Pips, it's Chris Lennon and welcome back to the channel. Today I got Jesse and James. We are going to be ripping packs, true creator, two hype trading cards to see who's going to be the first to pull the ultra rare and whoever does will win a thousand smackaroos and you get to keep the cards guys. Tell them to bring me my money. Yeah! What we're chasing after is a cracked ice out of 20. 20 cards or a relic card, Wait, whichever is the rare. 25 one? The, the oh. white and the blue. Well, you know the rare. Either one. Either, either one. one will win today's competition. But give this a thumbs up and make sure you guys subscribe right now if you haven't already. Yeah, we're just gonna talk about how we started True Creator. Do we have another partner as well? It's not just us. There's we have a whole, whole team, team now. Yeah, there's a whole team that goes We have a there. whole Dude, team. How many people do we have total right now? Nine. We've been working on this since June. For a long time. I'm gonna get to start off with a nice Jester auto. Hey! Jester auto starting oh, off yeah. with the auto. You gotta sleep it, sleep it. it. Damn, he's starting off with the He's starting Dude, off hot, James. I feel like it's the beginning of the video. I feel like we have to take it to the beginning. Like, the how did it start? Because you two started it. I wasn't in the, in the room first, so. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all start, started off. So, James and I, we were on the balcony, right? We were yeah, the balcony. just chilling on my balcony oh, back to the, the old 2 i house. Yeah, and then we were just, we always kind of like brainstorm, you know, at night after we're done working and everything. Hold on, hold on, Chris. No way. Oh! <laughs> too high! Hollow! Out of 500. 182. That's a sleeve. But yeah, so we were just talking and, you know, this was a time where I started recording and getting back into the hobby. You know, I was recording like the basketball training card openings. Even Pokemon, before the Pokemon craze, I pulled that shiny Charizard if you guys are subscribed to LSK. The gold Moochie. Bro. Oh, boys. Yo! Cash auto, baby. Hey. Oh, we got, we got a cash nasty. Now, with cash in his autos, he always... <laughs> Seems to like change his auto, so I hope you guys are lucky enough. I got the cash nasty. Some of them have just cash. cash. One um, of them had ye. Yeah, Zach's mom actually ripped some of these and she pulled a uh, cash ye. Hey and man. He, and he said he only signed that once. I also got an auto from Jesse, myself. Hey. <laughs> now guys, we will be giving Sweet. away these base autos. How many of these did we sign? Like, like 300, 300 per base auto. Yeah, dude. It was a process. You know, we wanted to make sure that, you know, these cards were just right. And, it, and we still learned some things too along the way as far as like how the manufacturing goes about. And that's why it took a really long time and then dealing with COVID too. Was yeah, great. COVID, like we were originally planning to launch in August. What? And then September and then October, and yeah. then November, and then finally December. Dude, we learned about like the and it foiling. Was still rushed. Like, yeah. the December launch was still rushed. Like an example of that is like, bro, we really didn't know what we were doing. Like, look how big this box of cards is. And look how small the pack is. Yeah, like, we didn't that, need to go this That way. raised our shipping cost so much like the thing is we never actually saw the box until like, well we was, saw like we saw the, the photoshop we saw the photoshop yeah. but not the box the size, itself yeah. the size and but now it's dope though yeah it's still it dope but the community box which we're launching very soon we already even started announcing the creators in that we have over 20 creators in this new box not just too high and i pulled oh. another hollow james is oh I'm speaking of hollows this. speaking of hollows hey hollow hey. jesse let's get it Yes, sir. Man. We came up with so many different types of cards. I feel like it just the amount of times we went through the card set and changed it was like at least like 12 times. We were like, all right, this is final. And then we would change it like a week Yeah, we, we, we did. Yeah, the thing I'm most exci I'm excited about for the community box is like with the two eye box, obviously there's only six people, so it's kind of hard, but it's like you're going to pull a bunch of duplicate base cards, but there's a bunch of different like types of base cards for the next one. So it doesn't feel like you're always pulling like the same white card over and over, which is going to yeah. be really dope. I'm excited for that. Yeah, guys, this was just literally like for two hype fans, the collectors of just, hey, this is the first of creator cards, like our first official box. You know, towards the end of the year, we're gonna have a lot more products for you guys and they're just gonna get better and better. I think, you know, one thing we learned too is like the setting of like the foils. So they actually come out even shinier too. Like the hollows look great now, you know, but we actually understood like a different step to make them pop even more. So I'm really hyped about that. And yeah, we're just, we've just been in the lab. Yeah. <laughs> hey, James, alert, alert. Hey. Clean 
Giant yeah, we, we have sacrificed so many Sunday nights to make like this just this box happen, let alone like the future ones. But yeah, we meet for like every, every single three hours, Sunday every, every for Sunday the last night. half year. Yeah, yeah. Every Sunday. still every Sunday. Yeah, still every Sunday. You know, and um, well, and more during the week now. But another hollow, another hollow Zach, another hollow Zach. Okay, I and mean, we, wait, I feel like we got off topic from the beginning. Who said the idea first between you two? I think Chris did. I came up with it, and I kind of just related to James. Like it was, it was like a click moment almost. Yeah. Like it's like, dude, because I was like, I was talking about how I just kept pulling like these random players that I just never really like heard yeah. of or seen play, and I was like, man, I, what if we just pulled us? You know, like a, a while ago, I actually did something with Panini where I had like a card, and like every time growing up too, I would, you know, when you do the team photos in basketball, I would always choose like the slot to make a trading card, and I just thought that was cool, and I was like, hey, there's not really any creator trading cards, and then we know how, like, we love trading cards as it is. I mean, Jesse, you started getting into, like, the basketball, even James, like, yeah. we were like, hey, why don't we just make our own company and create cards for creators, and whoever wants to be a part of it, be a part of it. So, yeah, it's just really dope, and then we, like, immediately hit up Jesse. Now, I um, walked up, to, when you got, you guys were just chilling outside, I walked up. Yeah, I think, yeah. I think you walked up, we were like, bro, oh, yeah, check we're, this. Dude. Dude, you guys were gas. <laughs> we're like, dude, we we're like, sit down. And then we just pull up a chair. We we're just talking, bro. And no, the craziest was um, did we hit up Adam first before Jesse? Or? Wait a minute. Hollow! Hey! I pulled myself! <laughs> so our business we have partner. Two out of 500. His name is Adam. And then you guys worked with him on your other card, uh, oh. the game. Dude, Dare to play. This is how we knew it was meant to be because we hit him up and because we were just like, we didn't know where to start, right? And then we were like, yo, Adam. So we got this idea. And when we faced Timed him. He's in a card shop. Like he, he like makes his own products. He makes cards. No, he was like, bro, I'm so into cards. He's like pulls out Michael Jordan rookie card, <laughs> just shows it to us. Like it's literally just arms reach away as we called him. He's like, oh yeah, I got LeBron's. Dude. I got Michael's. We're like, dude, who is this guy? This dude Adam, his card stash is more valuable than my net worth. <laughs> yeah, dude. Like he I... is a card god. And he knows how to make them. So we're like, dude, we started doing more research, and here we are. Yeah, the thing with Adam. Like he makes his own products. Sure. Like one of the products Adam's working on is he's doing like a presidential pack. So he has like Thomas Jefferson, and for his relics, he bought old historical documents of like people's signatures, and he's making relics with that. And I just think that's so cool. Like imagine pulling a freaking like Thomas Jefferson relic, and it's like yeah, some bro. old document with his signature. Like that's a product he's doing, but he, he does a bunch of crazy stuff. Dude, yeah. yeah. And then like even for like our relics too, like we got Big Shirt Jidel, we have our our merch jerseys that we wear in like videos and stuff and I think that's just so dope. Big uh oh, shirt. hold on. Oh, hello? Hey, hello? wait, wait, what number did you pull? 300. Oh, I got 302. 302. Ooh, 301 is hiding in here somewhere. Okay, the funny thing about the the numbering on the back of the cards, that raised the cost of production by a lot. so much. By thousands. Oh yeah. By thousands. thousands. Yeah. <laughs> just to put the number so it'd be cool. Like we were like, "Do we really no, we're like, no, fuck that. We're just we gonna need the numbers. Yeah, we, yeah. We, we we want the numbers. Like I pretty much in the printing, like someone has to do each of those by hand and like line them up. And yeah. it's just it just somehow it costs thousands of yeah, dollars I don't know. like to do the numbers. Yeah, we don't know why, but we just like, all right, whatever it costs, man. For the people. Yeah. <laughs> Some of the cards cost like a dollar per card to make, which like for Bro, a business is kind of crazy. No, no, more no, than that. The, the relics, more, yeah. The relics are over like fifteen dollars to make because Especially it's like for short. Us, Print. Because our company, like, we're not we a don't panini, print, we're yeah. not printing thousands of relics, like, we're only doing small quantities, so it's more expensive. Mm -hmm. But yeah, like, some of the cards are... Uh-oh, another cash, cash auto. Cash auto. Yo! I haven't pulled anything super, super crazy, but I think I have the most hollows. You, you definitely yeah, do. you definitely do. Dude, I only got one auto, man. My odds aren't looking... I have multiple Jester hollows, dude. Should mm -hmm. be excited. Well, let's talk about the odds. So, you get a hit every pack. You do get this cool, like, gold foil. One per pack. So, you actually have to open quite a few packs to collect them all. And then we have the, you know, the silver hollows that are numbered out of 500, then the base autos. But I actually, I don't know, the odds are a lot better than what we thought. It says five to six boxes you get an four auto, but I- But in reality- Four to five? Yeah. Four in reality, reality you really get an auto better. almost every box. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's one thing we want to like strive to do as a company is like keep our odds better than the all the other companies in the sport, like card trading world. It's a for a good price, 20 bucks. Dude, hit me up if you can see like a sports product. Ha <laughs> ha. 
for 20 bucks that has good valuable cards. Dude, I have never hit a cracked ice. I've opened like probably over like 30 boxes at this point. Uh, I've never opened a cracked ice? I've never opened a cracked ice. No. Nope. Damn. Guys, I've, I've, seen been, many I've been on the YouTubes and I've seen some of you guys watching do your own pack opening. I'm gonna do a little montage for y'all of just cool moments pulling some epic pools. Boom. <laughs> cracked ice. Triple auto. Oh, Whoa, 14 to 20. I gotta say, I wanna give a thank you to everyone who posted yeah. a video of them opening the packs. Like, I, it just made me so happy just seeing like people get happy, like Facts, pulling rare bro. cards and just like being super gassed. It's like all those months of like working on this product and make, making it come to life. Like that really like was like a special moment for me, just seeing everyone's reaction to it and people just being so excited about it and like getting more boxes. Oh, yeah, and, and I and the thing is like, I, what I can't even wait for, like obviously this is two hype and it's like, I can't wait to see like, in our next set where there's creators that you know their fans that maybe don't even know any of us are like gassed to pull you know yeah that dude so it's just like outside of just too hype you guys are gonna see more like creator cards and you know your favorite creators too that you know you may grow up or grew up watching and just you're just gonna continue to watch and see them grow you may even see a new creator that you find in our boxes and then you start to watch them too that's the beauty of it is like we're also like looking for creators that are very passionate in what they do and we see that and like you know they'll get a trading card and be inserted in the box and then you never know like they could just be the next big creator yeah and that's what's cool is so for on these cards on all like the common cards and the autos it's the first edition card this is kind of like a rookie card for you know content creators so you pull i don't know tim buck two and he's got like twenty thousand subs but he might get to like two million and then you have his rookie card effectively which is really cool another cash auto now this is how cash literally signs every card is different <laughs> but what's honestly like that's actually impressive it's way harder to mix it up than it is to like Sign, sign, sign. Like to mix it up is like impossible. Like, that's out, tough. Hey, shout out, shout to, out to the kid that <laughs> got a card with no auto on it. Dude, yeah. <laughs> I don't know how it slipped in, but Cash forgot to sign one. We so we sent the kid a couple boxes. I feel like that's a cool moment that you got one that just didn't have it because that's such a Cash thing. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Like he's Honestly. like, and then he even quoted on his story like, e. yeah, my auto. You know, I there was one card. I can't remember which one specifically. I just know it was. A rare one where I literally trailed the edge of the card and I was so like mad because I think it was like it might have been one of my one of ones which we do have and in inserted you guys need to tweet at us if you have any one of ones that you pulled because those are beautiful dude those are like my favorite cards those yeah, just those look have so like sick a... and speaking of like miss signings Zach oh. signed like three one of ones that were not meant to be signature ones so those, hey, are, kinda, like, those. those are like extra dope now because it's like if it doesn't look like one of these autos, like this template, then it wasn't meant to be signed. I think he signed like a base card that was supposed to be a one of one. But yeah, what, what can we look for in this next box, guys? Dude, That's there's gonna be a lot of dope relics. We're bringing on the jumbo relics. We're gonna have more types of base cards, so you're not gonna get anywhere near as many types of duplicates. Yeah, we're gonna have the- uh, Some red cracked ice. Red <sighs> cracked ice. We'll have a pink diamond. That was the one of ones will be pink diamond. Inserts. Insert oh, cards. Insert. The inserts are incredible. Picture. The inserts are fire. Boom! Insert right here. Dude, shout out to Jasmine. Absolutely killed, killed it. Killed the design. Our designers yeah, are A1. Zach. Shout out to Dylan. Dylan. Man. Yeah, Dylan is a he's a whiz, bro. He is a wizard. Big shirt Jidel Auto. You know the vibrations. Big shirt Jidel Gold Foil. Yeah, no, I'm super excited. Like the next box, like it's gonna be crazy. Just. 20 plus creators and I, there's so many creators I know people are gonna be so gassed about like it, we've only announced like three so far as of recording this and in the comments I just see so many people being like we want this creator we want this creator I'm just like oh just wait oh just wait. just give it a couple weeks and then this is just series one guys so when we get on to after series one then you guys will request who you want for series Jeez. two and it'll be just that much better now guys two hype isn't gonna be in all of like the true Every creator true products creator, either yeah. so we're gonna you know try to get as many content creators that you guys love and would love to collect 
in you know sorts of boxes and then we're gonna have different types of you know products that are more high class like a high premium chrome like card. a prism yeah like in the future we're gonna have like we want to do like a gamer box like we could even do minecraft gamers we could do vloggers like, vloggers like yeah. try to get like a different group like the vlog squad one day that like those are like the big goals big uh, goals who if you guys have one creator in the box like in true creator who would it be mine PewDiePie. Like, if PewDiePie, we made a yeah. PewDiePie card, that would literally be like, life is complete. That would be PewDiePie, so PewDiePie cool PSA 10. I was thinking about this, I was like, if we ever did a PewDiePie pack, like, it was just him, could we, we could do, like, all his Minecraft characters, but probably not, like, actual pictures of them, but, like, drawings. Mm -hmm. Like, he got Sven in there, dude, the dog. for me? That would be dope. Dude, I would, I would love to get KSI in a pack. Like, I think that would be so dope. KSI would be dope. Yeah, the Sidemen in general. I think... I'd love a freaking Nick Merckx card, bro. Nick Merckx? Nick, Nick Merckx, Merckx, that's my hard. guy. Hey, what would Nick his relic Merckx. be? Dude, a controller or something? I don't know. <laughs> like, yeah. The keyboard. It's gotta be the keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's well, scuff, bro. Oh, it's scuff. Come on, Jay. He's James. not Jay. He's controller. Oh, yeah, he is controller game. He's yeah, the only controller I guess controller Nick Merck one, Nick Merck's forget. relic with like his controller. It's like if you get the joystick, fam, like yeah. you've won life. Yeah, that would. Oh, I got a Jester Hollow. Hey, go. dude, these yeah, crack dice are looking slim, bro. Guys, we've been ripping for a minute, and it's it's tough out here. Got an auto though. Hey, TTJ. Dude, Jeez. Jason, my roommate, literally pulled one last night. I was kind of mad. He's like, How much to buy one of your boxes? I was like, Alright, if you give me lunch, I'll get you one of my boxes. Then he pulled blue cracked ice, Christopher London. Mm. I did pull a cracked ice on the stream or my Instagram, a London Christopher auto. <laughs> and I got, yeah, Jason got 19 and I got 20. That's crazy. Bro, I have still have not seen any of these cracked ice cards since I signed it and shipped it away. Hey. hey, James. I was trying to pull a relic for my video that we just filmed today, the trading card make the shot video. And I had to freaking buy one on eBay, bro, because I just couldn't pull one. For so the I video? Could, yeah, for the video. Freaking Big Sure Dried L cost me a cool 75. Hey, we finally hired a full-time support person. We did. If Our you support guys... email will be popping now 100%. Yeah, if you guys have any... <laughs> <laughs> issues with your orders hit up our support email <laughs> but yeah guys so the next product our boxes we're gonna have a hobby box oh that's yeah we so are. we'll have a blaster box and then a hobby box and then should we tell them about the insane box you tell them so we're having an insane box, which is a hobby box, but the odds will be slightly better. And it's only going to be the first 300 boxes. So if you're part of the first wave. 300 order wave, you will get like a sticker on that box that'll say insane on it. And yeah, that just means you got the juice box. Let's go. This is my best pull so far. Cash autos. Dude. It's the best two I bought them, man. <laughs> I got your Ooh, hollow. My hollow. Okay, okay. And also more fun facts with push. the future boxes. So in the hobby box, you guys are gonna be guaranteed an auto. The blaster box, you guys will guarantee like a hollow, insert rare card. Uh oh, Muchi auto. Let's Ooh. go, baby. Yeah, the Muchi auto, Zachary hollow. The regular box is 20, and the hobby box is gonna be 50. But the hobby box also comes with 12 packs. Yeah. Guaranteed auto. Get a like, lot of cards in the hobby box, guys. Sick. Those will be a lot like limited, so you want to get your hands on those as soon as they come out. You guys should definitely join the True Creator text community too, because we do pre-sales there and update those people the most. So I'll leave that in the description as well, just so you guys know exactly when it's going to drop. But it will be dropping soon, within the month. So. I'm not gonna lie, the one thing I am kind of nervous about for this next set is like, since we have all these different creators, it's like we gotta ship them the cards and then they gotta ship it back to us. And I'm just like, please let everything go smoothly. Yeah, dude. please let everything go smoothly. We ain't doing smoothly. no sticker autos. Nothing that we've had to go through has gone smoothly yet. So it hasn't. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see. Dude, yeah, so we're gonna try our best for our cards though. You know, I don't wanna say it in this video and then everyone clips it when we start, <laughs> if we start doing sticker, sticker autos. autos but yeah. It's just like, it's really hard 
different, you know, especially in a, COVID. in a COVID world. But, you know, in the future, when it's not, we're not dealing with, you know, a pandemic, we'll have events to where, you know, we'll have like signings and things like that. So we'll try our best to keep all of our autos on card. I know you guys, I love on card autos and I'm sure you guys do too. But, you know, it may get to a case where you have to do sticker autos depending on the creator and how busy they are, so. Dude, if you guys don't know about the, the card committee, like if you're like a rookie in the NBA, you will legit sign like 30,000 cards in a year. Dude, speaking of the rookies, younger players, LaMelo. I'm trying to pull a LaMelo in the, the, new, the new NBA boxes because before you pull like a college, like I don't, not even a college, it was his overseas jersey. Yeah. And I want him in an NBA jersey. Well, it's not even his overseas jersey, it's his overseas airbrush yeah. jersey. Yeah, the airbrush, it's just a blank jersey, but I need him in that Hornets jersey. All right, quick montage until we pull some heat. Chris, besides yeah. True Kato, let's talk about other cards. Yeah. What is your top, let's say top 10 cards, if you can remember them? Between Pokemon and NBA and even football. You know, all of my good cards, honestly, are in storage. Growing up as a kid, I was an avid, like, addict. Like, I'd open cards every single week. Like, my collection was disgusting. I have every rookie in the LeBron's draft class. I think I have every rookie from 2000 to 2006 six or seven, pretty sure. So like my collection is crazy. And I'm actually, I was gonna do a video before the pandemic hit where I go to my storage unit to get those cards. But... Can I see the sleeves, Chris? Whoa, calm down, Jamal. Oh, damn, James needs more sleeves. Listen, it... Oh, we got a Moochie Hollow. This is hard hey, to pull. You I got know. a Moochie Auto, hey, I got, got a Cash Auto. I mean, Hollow. Hollow? Sorry, Hollow. Hey. What about you guys? You have any? Dude, we have a ton of Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh cards from the 90s, but they're at our dad's house, which is currently being rented, so we don't they're have access to They're still there. Dude, what if every uh, hey, wait, track I want to talk about my though. collection, bro. Bro, I'm praying on Zach, Lefe on Zach Levine that he's going to do well. I got like 50 of his rookie Prism cards. I sent them all for grading, bought them all for like 40 to 60 bucks. So I'm just praying he gets traded to a lit team and just becomes like an all-star. Yeah, he needs to get to a higher market. Team, unfortunately, That's he has been balling, bro. He is so good. What are, what are your guys' best card or good card investments, you think? Comment down below. You know, I was thinking of getting a few De'Aaron cards. He's been, he's been hooping. That's a good call. Cash auto. Sleeve it! Oh, I got an auto. Oh, finally, an yes, auto, Chris! An LSK auto. Hey, I think that's the first one of the night. Let's, Let's go. go. All right, Jester auto. Let's Sleeve go! It. You love to see it. <laughs> do. Jester hey, hollow. Hey, you got the Jester Chris box. Is heating up. Oh my gosh. I'm on a roll. Ooh. Auto. Auto Zach. Golden Zach. Dude, I really want to win this. Forgot there was a competition going on yeah. the whole time. Oh my gosh, dude. My uh, This box has been amazing. Hollow. Dude. My, fuck. my fucking back hurts. Shit. All right, pull another Chris Auto. Let's hey, go. Hey, 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 hey. Leave it. I pull some heat. Cash. Chris. Jidel, Moochie, Duo, and a Cash Hollow! Yeah! yeah, guys, if you if you open these, you'll know if you get a relic card. Before you open them, because the pack looks like it's suffocating. <laughs> the th whatever's inside it is suffocating. They are thick guards. Oh, Ellis K Auto, I see you. Oh, you see. Come on, man. It wasn't even gas, bro. Man. I like, pulled, a lot, of, hey, I pulled a lot of autos today. That is true. You smell that? It smells like a cracked ice. Ooh, cash auto. Oh, don't do that to me. Dude, yay. <laughs> don't do that. Alright, my very last pack, last chance, crack dice. That's oh, a gold card, it is myself. Oh. Alright guys, so we just ripped through like 48 boxes? An absurd amount of boxes. Too yeah. many boxes. 
Unfortunately, our, our odds were not in our favor to pull a cracked ice, but just in case you guys haven't seen it yet, I did pull this London Christopher. So this is a blue cracked ice numbered 20 out of 20, yes sir, auto that I pulled on Instagram a little while, a little while ago. But that's what we were hunting for. Unfortunately, we didn't get that. So for this competition, I'm just gonna do whoever pulled the most autos and hollows combined. So we're gonna count that up. I have 24. Ooh, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, nine, 18, 19, 20, 21, 24, 25. 20. I have bad news for you both. I got 28. Oh. 28. <laughs> 28. All Four right. Cards. Well, the thousand was for the cracked ice, but I'll give you okay. 500. Hey, I'm, that's awesome. One, I'm two, two three, <laughs> four, five. Do you have any true creator boxes I'm gonna buy with this? <laughs> Hey man, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and learned a little something about True Creator. We have a bunch of dope products on the way. We have our community creator box, our first series one with a bunch of dope creators and we can't wait to launch that. And it's gonna be just a nice affordable way to get into the hobby if you wanna start collecting cards. And comment down below or tweet at us some creators you wanna see in a future set. And also don't forget to comment down below your Instagram for the giveaways, I'll be giving away some more boxes and some more autos from these guys. And uh, make sure you subscribe to James and Jesse. Make sure you subscribe to me, follow us. All our links will be down below. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. All right guys, so we pulled cards for about two hours and couldn't get an ultra rare cracked ice card. And then this happened as we were wrapping up, just fucking around, kind of disappointed. And this happened. Bro, we just fucking ended the video. I had one last stack of cards. I said, watch me pull a cracked ice in this last fucking pack. What the fuck? We just spent two fucking hours recording this oh, shit. And it's, the, oh my, it's a white cracked. It's even rarer. Oh my God. Oh my God. Sleep it. Sleep it. Hey man, here. Give me the rest. Card. Oh my. Bro, I literally just pulled the one in the middle. I said, watch this be a cracked ice. Bro, we just, I just, like, it's late. And I was like, bro, if we don't pull it in this box, I'm just gonna, let's just wrap it up. He said, one more pack. <laughs> oh my God. Dude, I'm mad because you guys are gonna say, like, oh, this fake. Like, oh, that's. Nah, bro, like, There's I'm actually. This pack right here, bro. And this is my pile. <laughs> Dude, I'm. Oh my video. god. Let's go! <laughs> fuck yeah! Dude, I'm opening all of these. I'm not giving these away, bro. What the fuck? I got another one! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! No! I just hung two in a row! Nah, dude, I'm dude. Fuck this. Back to back packs. No way. Back -back -back -back. Oh my god. What the fuck is this? <laughs> what is that? Cash! Dude, do I do I try to go three for three? No way. Do I try to go three for three no right here? No way. Yo! Oh my god. No! Get out of here. He's capping. Let's fucking go, Yo! bitch. Let's fucking go. Duo, the last one. 25, bro. What the fuck? Why didn't this happen when I had the whole fucking setup going, bro? <laughs> no, get out of here! Get out of here! No! This I can't believe that just happened. The creator trio. Oh my God, bro. All right, guys. Well, this is the outro now. So I <laughs> hope you guys enjoy more true creator products on the way. Make sure you guys go subscribe. Thank you for to all the support, y'all. Link down below. And. <laughs>